although there are many, many friendly faces among you, um, most of you don't know me, uh, but I would gather that most of you know that I am dying. Six weeks ago, I was given the news that my liver and bones are full of cancer. Just this past week, I found out that it spread to my skull. And today, even, I went for an MRI to see if it's gone to my brain. Estimates vary, but barring a miracle, it is likely that I will not be here in 6 to 18 weeks, or 42 to 126 days. Sounds like a long time when you're waiting for Christmas, or something that's on back order, but it, when it's the time that you have left to cuddle with your kids, or spend with your husband, it's terribly, terribly short. But cancer does not define me. Neither does being a wife or a mother. All of these things are a part of who I am, but they do not define me. What defines me is my relationship with Jesus. And that is why I'm here tonight. To tell you why Jesus defines me. To tell you what I have learned about what is really important in life. I have shed many tears over the past week as I grieve the reality of my death, and I will, no doubt, shed many more. But in the midst of my sadness, there is a deep and abiding peace and hope. A peace and hope that I would like for you to have too. So here are the things I have learned, the important truths I want my kids to know. Know God, know yourself, know the gospel, and know your purpose.